guys, welcome back. He's back and he's bigger than ever. Galactus has officially found his way to our Fortnite island. And we are only days away until the final event. In this video, we are covering all the secret changes that have been added in the latest update. All to do with the final fight against Galactus. You're not going to want to miss these secret changes. So if you want to support the channel, you can use the supporter creator code that is on screen. Apart from that, let's get into game. Oh my goodness, dude. Yo, everybody acting like a real gangster until this guy comes down. Oh my goodness. Guys, we're back in Fortnite. Yo, Epic Games has really turned up the notch for the event. Because Galactus... Oh my goodness, I'm surprised Galactus isn't already on our island. Look how close he is. Today, we've got a pretty epic video. We're talking about all the crazy updates that Epic Games has just added. This is like the event update. Or the update before the event update. This is the update that will explain what is going to happen in the update before the event update. And that event update is going to have Galactus in. Update, update update. I mean, seriously, though, we're showing off a bunch of crazy secret changes. We're talking a bit about the storyline and exactly what you guys need to know before the crazy events. Yo, there's, like, nobody around here to shoot. Yo, usually we have, like, a little bit where I shoot someone, they scream a whole bunch, it's really funny. Where is everyone? Yo, super quick, I just need a, a quick player, a quick default to run past for me to shoot. I'm trying to do an intro here. Anyone? Hello! Huh. Okay. Well, uh, <laughs> I guess let's just get into it. It is absolutely true. Galactus is coming to our island and he's literally days away. Players who've been keeping an eye on the skies will know that Galactus is getting bigger and bigger. And in the latest update, he is the biggest that he's ever been. We already have a date for when this event is most likely to go down, which seems to be November the 14th. So if November the 14th is in a couple of weeks time, and this is as close as Galactus is, we know Galactus is probably going to be here in about two weeks. But of course, where is Galactus going? Going to land? How's it all going to go down? Which locations are about to be affected? Well, players have managed to uncover exactly where this is all going to go down. For players with a keen eye, they will have noticed that in the Metal Pass lobby right now, we can see the exact location that Galactus is heading to. A giant exclamation mark has appeared in the Battle Pass right above the ruins, right in the center of our island. When we see an exclamation mark just like this, we know this has something to do with an event and of course, something to do with Galactus. What is even more crazy than this is something that was in the comic books for the Marvel Fortnite collaboration. We know one of the reasons why Galactus is coming to our Fortnite island is because he can sense the zero point. You guys remember the zero point, right? All the way back on our chapter one island in the center of our island was a giant powerful orb that all the members of our Fortnite island were fighting over. Yo, is that Thor? Hold on, Thor's on a jetpack. Hold on, boys. In the center of our island was a powerful orb that all the powerful players were fighting over. The visitor was actually trying to take over the power of the orb to take us into multiple dimensions. What well, the comic books tell us from the Marvel collaboration, that Galactus can sense the power of the orb. And he's coming to our Fortnite islands just to find it. Of course, if Galactus is now heading to the center of our island, we can safely assume that the orb, the zero point, is actually in the center of our Fortnite my island. That's a pretty big deal. That's a pretty big deal. So I, I'm, I'm really kind of flinchy and stumbling my words a little bit here. Um, there's a Thor with a jetpack around here and he's hiding. I don't know why he's playing these games. Ugh. That would mean literally right here in the center of our Fortnite island is the zero point. The most powerful orb in Fortnite. And one day we're going to be able to get inside. Hey, and maybe not just one day. Hey, maybe like really, really soon. I mean, if Galactus is successful, then maybe he'll actually get hold of the zero point. Oh, that would be crazy. Yo, speaking of crazy, I get a feeling we're about to come across a player. Cue the jump scare Pennywise soundtrack. Get it ready. Oh my goodness, dude. They're, oh my. Dude, they were everywhere. They were absolutely everywhere. All these players that didn't want to fight me, they came at once. Ugh. There's nothing worse than when somebody's so scared to fight you that they literally just wait for somebody else to jump you. Oh. Okay, and the craziness doesn't even end there. We've got to talk about. Oh, hold on. Just two quick seconds, guys. Oh, that was hard to watch. At least he's down. Ah! 
<laughs> there are still major changes going on at this Fortnite location that you guys really need to see. Uh, oh my goodness. Is that Iron Man? I'll go over there if that's Iron Man. I think that's Iron Man. Hold on. <laughs> Oh my goodness, what did we just witness? Oh my goodness. I long story short, it wasn't worth it, but we're back at this location. Please, epic, please. So there are some crazy secret changes going on at this location, all to do with the event, all to do with things that you need to know. Did you guys know that Iron Man is actually building something at these locations? Battle buses have been making an appearance, and this is like the second one to be constructed right here. We have two battle buses with what seems to be some kind of, uh, a, a bomb thing on top of it? What? This may seem like something that has been here since the start of the season, but it's actually actively been changing. And it all has something to do with Galactus. There is theories online that Iron Man is going to somehow destroy Galactus by sending these weird battle buses with some kind of black hole bomb and creating a giant black hole, sending Galactus off into another dimension. Or something like that. I think that's pretty- that's I think is a pretty good explanation of what people are saying. These are not bombs as you may think of them. These could be black hole bombs ready to send a giant Galactus destroying monster back into another dimension. I mean, they don't do it right now, clearly, because um, otherwise I would have just broke the game. Um, I, I think the- My screen's gone black. I guess it worked. <laughs> <laughs> These black hole bombs are only gonna come into effect during the event, and now that we have two, it seems like Iron Man is gearing up for the final event. Yo, bro, chill. Like, get out of here, bro. Every time I walk past you, you scare the life out of me. I think I'm about to get jumped. I feel like Iron Man in that jetpack is about to jump me again every time, bro. No surprise, my dude. Holy! What? What? Oh, and just when you thought it was all over, when you thought there was no more treats left, Epic Games and Iron Man come together and bring in this bad boy. I've been searching for hours for this, and suddenly I'm getting jumped by literally everyone. I'm terrified. Usually we don't talk about new items that are in forts that have just been added, but this one is particularly important because this has something to do with the final event. Oh my goodness, leave me alone, bro. I don't even have a weapon. Come on. Three hours down the pan, baby! You guys remember all the way back in season 9 on our chapter 1 islands? We had an event that starred the giant monster versus the giant robot in an epic battle for the final event. We the players were actually all given jetpacks so we could watch the final events go down because these giants were pretty big. So that's why Epic gave us jetpacks. Fast forward all the way to our chapter 2 islands. We're back in Fortnite. We know another giant is coming to the game and we've just been given an Iron Man's jetpack? Yo, could this be a recreation of what happened in the giant monster event? A giant creature coming to our game? And we're all able to fly up in Iron Man's jetpack so we can see all the drama? This tells us that Galactus is going to be on our island. He's going to be destroying stuff and we're going to be able to see it all from the air. I would love to show the jetpack off a little bit more, but of course no, I don't have it right now. As I said, three hours. It took me three hours to find it and um, please say this is it. Please say this is it. Oh, it's not it. It's not it. Yo, I was literally YouTubing how to find the jetpack and I watched the video and the guy was like, huh, it's my first time. I literally just found it straight away. That's crazy. And then there's me and I'm like, huh, I've literally spent three hours and I only found it once and some psycho took me out. Crazy, huh? Oh, I found him. I found him. I think this is a jetpack boy. This looks like a jetpack boy to me. Goodness, dude, when will it end? I can literally see now the final battle between Galactus and all of us. Him coming down above the ruins, maybe trying to break the ruins in half as we're all flying around him with our Iron Man jetpacks. That would be crazy. Speaking of the final battle, guys, it's time to get that double the day. I have no HP. I'm surrounded. Oh, okay. Double the day. <laughs> Of the day, everybody. There it is. Amazing. Anyone else feel like I get mistreated like a lot in this game? I don't. I, I really don't feel like any of this is very fair. Like ever. Three hours to find a jetpack. Instantly get it. Instantly get taken out. Go into next game. Try to get double the day. Iron Man one v ones me, and my only protection is a tree. It's amazing. Guys, if there's anything I missed, you gotta let me know in the comment section below. It's not long now, so get excited. I'm gonna catch you all in the next crazy season four for tonight's video. All right, guys. Peace.